Hello, everybody. Welcome to the uh, last of our little podcasting tutorials as far as adding content to your podcast goes. Um, this last one, we're going to be talking about how to add movies or video files to your podcast to make them a little more interesting than just the standard audio recording. So, once again, we're going to be working with the media browser over here on the right hand side of our screen. So make sure the media browser button has been selected, this one on the right hand side. And again, we have audio, photos, and movie options. And we're going to be working in the movies, so go ahead and click that. And you have a number of different libraries you can search through. If you have iMovie projects, they are available here. Your movies folder is also displayed, as well as iPhoto, Photo Booth, and your iTunes library. So wherever your video might be stored, uh, you should be able to access it. So I'll be working in my movies library. That's where I store um, many of my movies and video files. So once you have a movie uh, selected and you find one you want to use, go ahead and click and drag that movie into your podcast window and drop it in. Now, this is where um, GarageBand kind of doesn't want to work the way we want it to in that you, since we already have photos within our podcast, um, it wants us to replace those photos with this video file. Now, if we had a video file created outside of GarageBand that also included um, still images, um, it would work just fine. But in this case, we're going to replace our photo track with this movie track by clicking Replace. And it's going to insert that short video into the podcast. And you'll notice up here we have our movie track at the very top with thumbnail images of our video. And then it drops the soundtrack for that video into its own track. So we could move it, adjust the audio levels, things like that. So that's kind of our final piece of content we're adding. We have gone over vocal recordings, sound effects, jingles, photos, adding songs, and now finally adding video content to our podcast. So our next video is going to kind of demonstrate a final product as well as how to save it and transfer it to iTunes uh, to either download to other devices like iPods, MP3 players, things like that, or publish to uh, the iTunes store and make it available for subscription. So check those videos out.